this next topic. So you're probably interested in buying a Tesla right now and you're trying to figure out all the different solutions or all the different options on how to finance or buy your Tesla. So we're going to go through all that explained and kind of give you a Tesla financing guide for 2024 and give you all the different options. And on top of that, I'll give you a credit union or actually a financing bank that has lower interest rates for Tesla financing or lower interest rates than Tesla financing at the end of this video. So let's take a look at it. But if you're just joining in, my name is Dennis. I love talking about Tesla deal hacking. So definitely hit that subscribe if you're interested. So the first thing here is not every single vehicle qualifies for the full 7,500 federal tax credit. And some of the vehicles get it at point of sale. That's all model wise. The lowest trim of the Model X with no options added and the Model 3 performance. But of course, we've got the Model 3 Highland. So a little bit of a confusion there. But the first thing here is well, you can pay cash. Of course, you can also use outside financing. But if you got full cash, it might be the best option to do that. The next one is a lease where if you lease the vehicle, the leasing financing company, which is Tesla leasing or Santander or one of the other banks that they use, they get the full 7,500 and they pass it to you as a itemized discount on the vehicle. So then you can't qualify for it yourself. You can't put it on your taxes, but they put it as an itemized 7,500 on a lease and you get that value. But of course, with residual values and money factor interest rates on a lease, some of that stuff gets raised up. And so you might not get the full lowest payment at the end of the day for that. And the last one, the biggest one that probably most people go with is a loan because you can get the full 7,500 as well, as long as the vehicle qualifies. And the interest rate for Tesla financing right now is 6.59%. Of course, there's plenty of ways to get a lower financing payment that, than that. And of course, the lowest way to get a monthly payment is actually by going through our channel sponsor, which is Tenet. Down below in the description, there is a Tenet link where you can try and get the lowest monthly payment for your Tesla. They can do this because they are a Tesla approved financing partner and defer a portion of the loan, maybe even that 7,500 federal tax credit. So definitely check out Tenet down below in the description. And thank you to Tenet for sponsoring this video and a bunch of other videos this month. On top of that, Tenet has add-ons, which you can finance as well, including EV charger and installation, extended warranty, and I would say gap insurance, which you can also add on, which is a very important thing that you need to add on for Tesla vehicles because Tesla vehicles, you never know, Tesla could drop the price of a vehicle pretty quickly. But thank you to Tenet for sponsoring this video and a bunch of other videos this month. But going back to lease, of course, leasing is going to ultimately be your lowest monthly payment for financing a Tesla or leasing a Tesla, but it is a pure rental. You cannot buy the lease out at the time of this recording. And so you are not able to take advantage of any sort of equity pay down or equity positive equity position at the end of the lease. So purely just a rental. But the cool thing is you could do a 24 month lease for about the same amount as a 36 month lease. You can see at 36 months, it was $439 a month. And at 24 months, it was $449 a month. So you can see if you just need a vehicle for like a year or two or two to three years, then it could make a lot of sense by going through a lease. If switch, if you're going to be leaving the country or maybe you're going to move to a city where or you know you're going to be moving to a city where you don't need a vehicle, then it could certainly make a lot of sense. But loan is going to be your best option for financing a vehicle as long as you qualify for the loan yourself. But right now, Tesla financing is at an interest rate of 6.59%. And probably the one of the biggest banks that a lot of people might qualify for or maybe have family that can qualify for is Navy Federal Credit Union. Right now, if you qualify for the Navy Fed Credit Union rates, you can see that they're going to be lower than Tesla financing. And there's plenty of ways to qualify, even it's as simple as if someone in your household is a member or can qualify for a member. That's what it says in the stipulations. As long as you're in the same household, then you should be able to qualify as well. But you can see right here for a 60 month term, it is at 4.99% all the way from the up to 60 months. And then from 61 to 72 months, it's 5.29%, which both of those rates are way lower than the 6.59% than Tesla. But what I can say is this, Tesla financing is going to be 
your easiest approval for getting approved for your financing loan. So if you're a first time buyer, you're most likely going to have to use Tesla financing, which is not the end of the world, 6.59 versus 4.99 or any other credit unions out there. But if you're a first time buyer, you're most likely have to go through Tesla financing and you're most likely going to have to put 10 to 20, most likely 20% down, maybe even 30% down to get approved for the financing. Yes, you can do refinancing and refinance through other credit unions and get these great rates as posted on the screen, but you really have to have good credit to do that. And so most likely you're going to have to do Tesla financing, keep the loan for like six months and then try and refinance at a later date. But of course, if you're looking for the best list of all the different credit unions out there that all have interest rates lower than Tesla financing, you can find that on my Patreon link down below in the description. After you join, you get a link to my buying guide, which is the ultimate Tesla buying guide out there with all the best interest rates for financing your Tesla. So definitely check it out. Patreon link down below in the description. And if you're looking for some one-on-one -on -one support for buying a Tesla, you can do that. You can schedule a call with me by after joining the Patreon link, or you can send me DMs and messages with any questions you have. And on top of that, before you place an order for any of your Tesla vehicles, don't forget to use a Tesla referral code, just like the one down below in the description. So you can get three months of full self-driving, which is valued at $600 because it's $200 a month for a subscription. So $600 in valuation just for purchasing and using a Tesla referral code.